the next update is more or less a quality of life update and that is before winter 25 release when i'm interested in getting the content of the current web component i was using the syntax which is this dot template dot host meaning whatever content that i have within the web component if i wanted to get it the syntax was this dot template dot host if i wanted to get the kebab casing of the web component in that case i was using this dot template dot host dot tag name starting winter 25 the syntax is made much more easier i can get the very same output by using the syntax which is this dot host element and this dot host element dot tag name to get the kebab casing of the web component to demonstrate it let me go back to the salesforce org just to save some time i have already dragged and dropped the web component onto the account record page i'm going to reload the page If you look at the console log, this output here is related to the logs that we have here, which is nothing but the code snippet using the old way of addressing the host and the tag name. So host is going to give me the entire content of the web component. Tag name is going to give me the kebab casing of the web component name. The output here is pretty much similar to the output that we have above. And I'll be getting this output when I use the syntax, which is this dot host element this dot host element dot tag name as mentioned earlier it's more or less a quality of life update that's all for this episode see you in the next one